All right, family. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. Um, this is one of the reasons I don't mess around in Brooklyn no more. I used to spend a lot of time there um, with my cousins. I used to go there every summer as a kid, actually. And um, one of the reasons I just, as I got older, I quit going is because I'm really afraid of rats. And um, this story right here just solidified for me. Just, uh, well, let me just share it with y'all. Mm, 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 mm. The deceased man found at the bottom of a New York City manhole early Tuesday morning has been identified as 41-year-old Gabriel Caesar. The New York Post reports the police have been unable to identify a fixed address, so he may have been homeless. Surveillance footage from the early hours of September 30th captured Caesar falling into an open manhole near Columbus Circle in Midtown Manhattan. Verizon workers replaced the cover over the manhole several hours later without realizing that Caesar was inside. Caesar's badly decomposed body was discovered on Tuesday morning, 15 days after he fell into the hole. The public commission has now launched an investigation. The decomposed body of a man found in a New York City manhole early Tuesday again has been identified as Gabriel Caesar. Caesar walked into the open manhole note located at Columbus Circle in Midtown Manhattan around 2.30 a.m. He fell down a 20-foot hole. Police believe that he may have been intoxicated at the time. The shocking vision showed Verizon workers covered up the manhole several hours later without realizing that he was inside. He remained missing for more than two weeks before his remains were found on Tuesday when workers were installing phone lines on West 58th Street and 8th Avenue. Three men first noticed a strong smell when they removed the manhole cover before making a grisly discovery. Caesar's body was so badly decomposed that the police could not immediately tell his race. Police say his flesh had been partially eaten away by the rats. And on Tuesday, police blocked off the road as they exhumed the body from the deep hole. Grisly images show Caesar's flesh having been eaten away as his corpse was hoisted out of the hole. Oh, God. So I'll tell you about the rats. A strong stench could be detected around the area for hours and hours afterwards. The New York PD, NYPD spokesperson has not responded uh, for Daily Mail a request for a comment. But the Public Service Commission has now launched an investigation into why the open manhole was not being properly monitored at the time when Caesar fell in. Oh my God, y'all, please tell me what you think about that. Oh God, uh, that's what I was trying to tell y'all about my neighbor. But fortunately for him, it was. I mean, I mean, he was still dead. He didn't feel nothing. But it was mice that was eating on him, and I am constantly throwing mice poison out all, all around the property and all around on the sides because the house was so infested with mice. And, of course, he passed away in the house and they didn't have no food. So, what you think? But this right here is just disgusting and um, it is so sad. Oh, God. So, tell me y'all what y'all think about this story. Mm. And did you hear it? I mean, do you think New York is really responsible for having that uh, manhole open up like that? And so, oh my God. So, I mean, that is, oh, it would seem to me that cameras all over the street everywhere, you could have saw this guy when he fell in. Um, if somebody's manning the cameras, I mean, what the hell? 
Oh my God. I mean, this is insane. It said this the smell was unbelievable. Doing this kind of job, you'd expect to find some strange things in manholes or sewers, but this is a first. Oh, uh, God. He said, it said the man was wearing a T-shirt and shorts when he fell into the hole. Oh, they really was getting, ooh, eat his ass up. Uh, in upstate Buffalo, a nine-year-old girl broke birth her anchors when she fell 12 feet into an open manhole in 2017 and was trapped inside. In 2016, a six-year-old Bronx girl fell eight feet into an open manhole outside St. Mary's Park in the Bronx. The girl was plucked out of the sewer by a passerby, escaping the ordeal, frightened but uninjured. Then we got another girl. I remember uh, Alexa Longoria, 15, was walking with a friend when she plunged into a hole, suffering minor scrapes and cuts. You know, so it, you know, it would seem to me that y'all would make sure somebody is manning these holes, that people can't just fall into these holes and not be spotted or worse yet, end up with the same fate as Mr. Caesar. Y'all, tell me what you think about this story because I think it's just disgusting. All right. Please like the video, y'all. Come on, it don't take but a second to hit a thumbs up. That's all it take. I ain't asking you for nothing. All I'm asking you for is a like. So with that being said, I'll see you in the next video.